Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> we got some big news going on right now in the community. Um, Blizzard's going to be bringing back seal twisting for paladins. Uh, I've never seen the community more divided, especially with the paladin community. Um, personally, for me, I never played Rep Paladin in TBC when the silt twisting was popular. Um, people are calling it the best time for Rep Paladins. Um, but the way other people are describing it as a kind of blatant bug abuse of how game mechanics are versus how actual spells should be in the game um my personal opinion it kind of just feels like blizzard's putting a band-aid over rip paladins just hoping that um this solves the issue and people are happy with it um and other people are saying that them adding seal twisting in the game is not going to change anything and it's actually going to be worse um we'll find out i'm sure there'll be a bunch of testing um seal twisting kind of sounds <laughs> in my opinion kind of sounds really trashy especially with the other way people are describing it um but here's the blue post there there's other um classes getting tuned druids are getting a little buff there with their damage um swift men no longer consumes rejuvenate or regrow so that's really good for druid healers Shadow Priests are getting a 10% buff. Um, Rogue Saber Slash is getting a buff. And Shaman, Elemental Shamans are getting a buff. They're allowing the Flame Shock damage to last its whole duration. So you can use, you can use a Lava Burst like twice, I think I said. Anyways, we'll get into the meat and potatoes here with Paladins. That's what we really care about. Seal of Righteousness can now be a critical hit. Um, Sacred Shield's duration is extended to 30 seconds, or sorry, to 60 seconds. It was 30 seconds. And Crusader Strike now gained an additional effect. Crusader Strike now refreshes all adjustment effects active on the target to a 30 second remaining duration. So Crusader Strike refreshes the judgment on the target, which is cool. Um, and then, yeah, Seal of Martyrdom can now twist with other seals, including Seal of Command. Um, so basically what you have to do in how it makes sense to me is you have to, if you have one seal on, if you have, you have to have seal of martyrdom on, and then right before your character hits the target, you have to activate another seal so that both seals are hitting at the same time. And you have to do that within a split second <laughs> that you're about to hit. Um, but currently with how paladin rotations are going is exorcism is your main your main bread and butter right now so if you're not exorcising yeah if you're not exorcising whatever then you're losing dps i can't exorciser exorcising exorcising if you're not exercising them then you're not doing it right <laughs> my brain's not working with that anyways <laughs> You guys understand what I'm saying. Don't be making fun of me in the comments. Um, anyways, we're going to jump in. Um, <laughs> pretty popular post on the classic WoW forum where this guy is saying he wants Divine Storm, not Twisting. Or we want that. Um, we already have Divine Storm, but I think they just want to put it on a different piece of gear so it's not Whistle of Martyrdom. <laughs> this guy says, I just want a healing rune. Pally Discord servers say otherwise. The current rotation would be better than twisting. Yeah. I. That's what it seems like because if you're twisting, you're using more mana. We're already struggling with mana. The current way the rotation is, we're perfect on mana. Unless you're like spamming the crap out of your uh, consecration. Um, we've been really good at keeping our mana like really healthy. Um, of course, you can still run out of mana spam and consecration but in my opinion it's really healthy right now it's not starving adding an extra seal in there especially like <laughs> seal of righteousness or seal of the what was the other one seal of uh command that's right seal of command i couldn't think of it for a second um it's gonna be eating even more of your mana so yeah we'll see um guys so 
Twisting made TBC Ret the most fun spec I've ever played in all of World of Warcraft. I'm ecstatic. That's crazy. Same, 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 same. That's that's crazy. That's crazy. Bro, I just want to use seal command. That's it. Seal twisting option is good for people that want to do it. Uh seal twisting isn't even that good of worth doing. Um, if you're able to waste globals waiting for a swing timer to swing or twist, you're playing the wrong class. Yeah. No one, and I mean no one, will be doing more damage seal twisting than just playing with martyrdom itself and spamming, yeah, exorcism, exactly. Um, if you're unlucky, you maybe get two to three globals in between exorcism procs, um, and you'll feel that with crusader strikes and judgment. You end up losing time waiting to use a global with your swing timer. timer. Uh, he says it's brain dead and that twisting will be viable. Eh, I don't know. Twisting is peak fun. What? These people say it sounds fun. It doesn't sound fun to me. You want Divine Storm. We want Twisting. TBC is the best version of Red. Rest. <laughs> okay. Twisting is back, baby. Dang. Okay. That guy doesn't care. Speak for yourself. Many Reds, including myself, think TBC Ret was the most fun version of the class in any expansion. Seal Twisting is 10 times more fun, interesting, and unique than Whirlwind But Yellow. Like he's talking about Divine Storm. Um, and don't start. But, 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 mandatory add on. You need items from a high level with basically any class in the game. Eh, nah, not really. Um, that's just the way the game is. Um, no, rogues don't need anything crazy to perform really high right now. That's the other class that I play. <laughs> uh, this guy played, yeah, he's played a lot of ret, but he's, he still says it's, it's his favorite is seal twisting. I don't understand why swing timers may need to optimize his tree different compared to other specs in the game. Uh, so twisting stupid. <laughs> Basically, yeah, this guy, it's basically a blatant bug from 20 years ago and still exists entirely outside of how the spells are supposed to work by their in-game in, uh, in -game descriptions and their relies on a third party and on the use. Uh, this is a dumb mechanic. No, you are. No, you. No, you. Stop trolling me. This is this is how Reddit usually, usually is. <laughs> It's been supported in, in, in intentionally by the devs for years. Hmm. I want twisting. Never wanted divine storm and vanilla. I want twisting and divine. Oh, this guy wants both. There, he says. Screw art of war and any form of spell power. Rep. Okay. If you want already swing timer, you're just a bad play. Wait, if you aren't already using swing timer, you're just a bad player. Stop trying to speak for. A okay. Reach, brother. Screw twisting majority of out of touch den team. Ooh. They're out of touch because they made an alternative playstyle work again as a worse secondary DPS rotation. Okay, so this guy is this guy is saying it's gonna be worse. Worse secondary DPS rotation. Interesting. Most of the community has been complaining about our rotation since phase two or tied to a single weapon that'll be best in slot even at 60 yeah they're complaining that that's another thing is like apparently to seal twist you need a two second speed weapon for it to work well you already need a two second speed weapon to be able to do decent dps as a paladin apparently yeah they're going to leave acp soul threes as best in slot at 60 I heard there's going to be other options. There's going to be better options. If you're still using ACP at level 60, that's going to be ridiculous. You're talking about how the devs should give Paladins a new rune that does one of several things, ignoring the fact that you don't know they aren't already planning to do so. I swear some people just be making stuff up. Time to park my pally. I've literally been leveling a paladin 
just to start playing. I didn't want to play Exorcism Spam or Tisting Spam. I want to play a heavy, slow hit and paladin that actually uses Crusader Strike and Divine Storm. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's crazy. Time to level up Paladin. SOD Dev just pandered to loud vocal minority in all regards instead of putting real work to fix and create interesting gameplay. Maybe it's a small team, maybe it's laziness, who knows? All I know is it's not worth my money anymore. You're very dramatic, but you're not wrong, but you're also not right. Um, they literally said in their post previously that it's... This phase is only going to be out for a couple more weeks, and then we're going to be 60. And after that, the phase is probably going to be longer because we've got all the different rays that are going to be coming out. So we're going to be 60 for a very long time where they can actually start balancing the classes. It's There's no point to balancing the class level 50. They're going to have to do it again at level 60 anyways. So, yeah, I think this the seal twisting thing is just to put a band-aid over it and make the seal twisting people happy that wants it. I say, yeah, just give it to them. I, I personally don't think it's going to change gameplay very much. If Seal Twisting becomes the new, like, rotation for DPS, I mean, so be it. I'm sure we can figure it out. There'll probably be new add-ons for it. This guy absolutely hates Seal Twisting. Why can't I get SOC back without Twisting? I'm so bummed. Twisting is cool for some people. Twisting is fun. You want Divine Storm. <laughs> I have a feeling like I would say the majority of people have no idea what seal twisting is and this very small minority of paladins is very loud and I'm sure there's people even on here that have never never even seal twisted before a day in their life um, it'll be interesting to see what happens. Honestly, it'll honestly be really interesting to see what happens. Apparently, these changes are going to be going live tomorrow, April 23rd. And uh, we'll kind of see. I'm excited. I'm hoping, all I'm hoping is that Paladin's better. But just give it, you know, give it a little love. Hopefully, Crusader Strike and the Seal of Righteousness damage will help out. But, uh, yeah, I just definitely need a little bit of love. I think people are a little too dramatic, a little too serious um, <laughs> about the game. It's just a game, guys. We just want to have fun. doesn't have to be anything too crazy. Uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, like I said, I'm for and against Steel Twist, and I don't think it's really going to change the game too much. Um, yeah, let me go. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. You guys have a great day. Thank you for watching.